Hi, I'm Rachel and welcome back to my channel. So on a Thursday, I would normally do a weigh-in update. However, I'm not going to be, things are going to change. So what is going to change um, is I'm going to go to monthly weigh-in updates and I'll talk to you about that in a moment. So I've really thought about this for probably last week and it's been playing on my mind and then I wrote my thoughts and feelings down in, in my little notebook what I've got and I think I've lost focus of why I started losing weight. So we all have our reasons why we want to lose weight and they're all different. My reason for losing weight was to feel good in my own skin, to get to a place which I would call my happy place where I felt comfortable in my own skin, I was healthier for the children and um, I wasn't out of breath just walking upstairs and um, I got more I had more exercise in my life um, and I just felt a lot better and I had a lot better outlook on life and I've got there and what I've realized is I've been so fixated on the numbers that I forgot why I actually started losing weight I started losing weight to feel good in my own skin and sitting here today I feel comfortable in my own skin. Now, I started Slimming World in 2017 in the September and by the May the 2018, I had lost my four stone in weight and I just felt amazing. And I maintained that for a whole year. Then I became poorly and went down to four and a half stone weight loss. And then I realized that I was so close to five stone that I would go for my five stone um, award and I got down to my five stone award and as quickly as I got it I realized that I couldn't maintain that weight loss it, I just couldn't have that happy balance um, and so it's from then um, I've been to and fro from Slimming World and my weight has been up and down but it's never gone where I can't control it to bring it back down and I've sat around where I am today, I don't know what I am because I've not got weight, but like from last week's weight, I've sat around this number for quite a while. And I've always said that I'll be, I'm happy where I am, but I'll be a lot happier back then, back lower down to the 12s. Well, will I? Because I only stayed down at the 12s for a very short period of time. And then I went down to, into the 11 brackets. And yes, I enjoyed it like I was 11, 11. Um, but my clothes never changed. Um, I just, I think it just felt good being a bigger person that I was down to 11 stone 11 and I was like 11 stone. It just felt amazing for my height and things like that. But I never yeah, did it. I achieved it. I got my five stone loss and I was like amazing. Like you've lost five stone. That's incredible. But was I really truly happy? Probably I was I was happy that I'd got my five stone and been like, yes, look what I've got. But deep down, I'm not any happier than I am now than I was back then. Um, and I think I've just missed the point, started losing weight. And I'm happy. I got to where I want to be. And I just don't want to be doing these weekly weigh-ins and be fixated on the numbers. I want it to be a monthly thing where I can look at the whole month and look at my non-scale victories. So that could be, I don't know, like my, I'm gonna do my measurements as well on the 19th of October, because I've not done them. It could be that I've lost a few inches on my, I've lost a few inches around my waist and my thighs. Um, I set little goals that like I want to do 10,000 steps a day. Um, and set little challenges within the month and then look at that um, yes my weight is important because I don't want to go ever go back to where I started from because I wasn't in a good place then but I need to have a little bit of need to realize that I've done the hard work I've done the hard work to get me here um, and now I just need to maintain it and I don't want to see, some people like to see their weekly weigh-ins and if that's for you, then I'll support you 100% because losing weight is a very personal thing and you have to find A, a plan which works for you, something which, which fits into your lifestyle and it is so personal losing weight. And whatever plan you follow, um, I am right behind you because 
whatever plan you follow and you put your mind to it you will lose weight on that plan um because they're all tailored completely different and you've just got to find a plan which works for you slimming one was a plan i chose um and that was it and I, f I followed Slimming World and now I choose calorie counting because this moment in time I enjoy that however what I will just touch on is what I've realized is is the calorie counting I've been doing as well and I'll hold my hands up to it is it's not been the healthiest of um counting calories that is um I've realized that I've not been eating a lot of fruit and veg and nutritional, nutritious food. It's been a grab and go. However, bringing it back is my husband's been working late, We've been doing a house. Um, so yeah, it's just been, everything's been up in the air um, kind of thing at the moment in time. So my calorie counting, as much as I've been calorie counting, it's not been the healthiest choices. So we're going to rectify that. And that could be like a little monthly goal next month. Like I could, I want to eat five portions of fruit and veg a day. Um, Cause that does track it on the Nutri check. It does track your little, your little apple, which you need to fill. So I will be monitoring that going forward. So this is basically just to say that I am now going to go monthly. So on the 19th of October, I will weigh in and then I will set some monthly little targets that I want to achieve within the next month. And then four weeks from the 19th of October, I will come back, re-weigh myself and we'll go from there. And we'll see how I do. And also going forward with my channel, there's going to be a lot more what I eat in a day. Um, it's like a little food diary. I've just got to remember my reason for starting losing weight. And, and keep that in the forefront. It was never to do with a number on the scale. It was never to do with numbers. It was to do with a feeling. It was a feeling of feeling comfortable in my own skin. And it was a feeling of feeling better in my own skin. And I achieved it. And I think, and I've just been fixated on what those scales are going to say than what I actually feel like. Um, so yeah, that's why, and that's why I'm going, what I'm going to start doing. So um, yeah, I feel so much better making that choice and, and telling you, um, because there is a little bit of an element when you do vlog your journey, that if you do get a gain, you feel like you've let um, yourself down and you've also feel like you've let yourselves down. Um, so just having a month of the way in, you just, just be amazing. I know it will and it's the best thing at this moment in time going forward. Now, things can change, weight loss journeys change um, and I'm not saying that I won't go back to weekly if I think monthly is not working, who knows? But at this moment in time, we're gonna give this a go um, and see where, we, where it goes in the future. So just to say that whatever plan you follow, I hope you've had an amazing week on it. And um, as always, sending huge, positive thoughts. Bye!